What's up everybody on YouTube? A little update video of what's going on with this behemoth right now. I did a little playing with the plumbing going through the wall. That goes through the wall into the next room which is a master bathroom down the wall and then it's got a rubber hose that I can take on or off of the, the faucet so I have a warm cold water flowing out of that that I can have a temperature adjustment every time I do my refill so I can just go right through the wall so I've got maybe I don't know six feet of pipe in the other room and then this coming right into here and yesterday this this tip had a a rubber line on it going down into the sump if you look in the sump see the pipe in there pipe coming up pipe going into that outlet there actually that's an inlet there's a new pump down in there I don't have real good visibility on that let's see if the flashlight will give us a little bit of a show what's hiding in there there we go that is the new return pump it's a Danner high drive pump in we can see the water level right there that little white mark right there that's where we are our water level we got about half full on this sump as of yesterday and the other other line goes down on that side so right now we have a sump that's running into itself I don't have all the rest of the piping run obviously I haven't waterproofed the tank yet so that would be the step after that uh, Let's see, let's see and make it simple. When I, it's a little bit loud right now. This is going to be the return line coming up. I'm going to have a 45 up, then another 45 taking it back. And that line is going to go right back to that window return. Where we're going to go underneath it right now and show you. It'll pop out over the tank over the sump and it'll go from there right along to there and then up behind and into the back of the tank up at the top of the one and a half inch bulkhead I've already drilled for my two inch bulkheads one on each side and here <laughs> I had a fun time yesterday playing with this it is actually running right now. It is running. It is, it is funny, it's running into itself. So it's pressure, it's not being draining, it's just pressure going into here. In here. I don't know if it's visible for my top tray on both sides. The holes that I drilled work out adequately. They can they can deal with all the water that's going to be going through there just fine, which is going to trickle down from there. It's going to trickle right down across all the media and pop out. There's a sponge. This is all going to be illuminated when I get this all done. I'll have lights in here. So right now it's kind of a, it's a very rough video, but I just wanted to share what's going on with everybody. It's my sump. I couldn't have it underneath here and not have water in it. I had to try it out. I had to try out my new pump. Oh, I feel so clumsy climbing around under there. But anyway, up here back on the top side, here is my two inch bulkhead, Schedule 80 bulkheads, and this is the return pump. So I'm not going to be using the two 1800 gallon per hour mag drives, I'm using this one individually, which actually uses a little less wattage than those together, and puts out some more pressure than those combined, so I think it's a win-win with that. Alright everybody, that's the plumbing through the wall, that's the sumps working, that's the return pump working, and more coming at you soon. Water ceilings coming up later.